Hi guys, so today we're going to have a look at Viola Time Joggers and we're going to have a look at Pick a Bale of Cotton. So we've just got our music up just now. So we can see that we've got a couple of um, repetitions in this piece. So if we just jump to like the third and fourth line, you can see the first two bars there are exactly the same, same with the third bar. And then the second and the second last line is exactly the same there as well and then we've got the same music from the last line as we do the third and fourth line okay so let's have a we go from the beginning I will play you the first line so you can hear how it goes so three one two three four just that very first line and we need to make sure we count out for that last bar but we'll come on to that in a second so ready so nice big bows and nice round bow holes ready starting open a one two ta ti ti <laughs> first line so we're gonna go from wait wait and so on so this time let's just have your bows down by your side and we'll follow it through for the fingers so we're going from bar four which is the last bar in the first line ready so follow with your fingers so wait wait D one D three on D last bar so ready open d3 and d wait wait d one d second line with the three so let's just practice that a little bit a few times so three in the a three and three one open a three in the d and once again three in the d and three one on a open a a little bit faster this time three and okay let's put it together now so the last bar of the first line ready three four d wait Wait, do one, two. So we need a slow bow, so ta, 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 te, 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 ta, ta. Okay, let's have a go. So low two on that A string. Ready, first finger on A. Space your first finger. So three, four, one, low two. time and let's focus on the bowing the time it's going to go down up 
Okay, ready? So low two and bowing and rhythm. Ready? Three, four. Low two. We're going to run the third and fourth line. So you can see the fourth line is just exactly the same, and then we'll come to that um the bar that changes a little bit. Ready? So third line. So three, four. C natural, up bow, up again, three and D. is line four and on the last bar okay ready so on it's going to go with D two three D one D okay let's have a go ready three and D two two three D one D great let's have one more go so last bar of the fourth line ready so open D three and D straightforward that we've got um, a few um, repetitions of the same music. So once you feel nice and comfortable with this, the next stage is to then add in the dynamics. So we can see that we've got the F which means forte, so that means a nice loud sound. Then we've got mezzo forte on the third line, so that's just going to come down a little bit in dynamic, so a little bit softer there. Then the fourth line's a little bit louder. And then we will, there's double F, which means forzando, so fortissimo. So that'll be really, really loud in that last bar, and the last line's a little bit quieter. So, just before we finish, I will play you it one more time. Once you're happy with the notes, what I'd recommend you to do is have a look at the performance video of this, so you can have a play along with at home. Ready? So, from the beginning, three, four. <laughs> helped you guys as I said before if there's any part that's a little bit tricky just rewind it back and so you can do it as many times as you need to okay doke any questions drop me an email and happy practicing